Another tip for adjusting your Acer S7 settings is going to adjust your trackpad. So let me take you there. You click the little arrow down here and then the little trackpad icon and right click on the trackpad and go to properties of touch. I recommend increasing the pointer speed, leaving enhanced precision on, and then going into Elon, and then going into options. Now this is a very tiny screen, so let me bring this up closer so you can see. One second, and I'm going to adjust the focus. So right here, you can adjust what tapping does, one finger and two finger tapping. You can also adjust what clicking, so tapping uh, with two fingers and tapping with three fingers and left click and right click, what it does. You can adjust the drag and drop and your edge swipes, so for the charm menus and etc. And you can also enable multi-fingered uh, actions uh, such as pinching to zoom and rotating and and uh, four finger swiping and scrolling so you can do that there and you can adjust the sensitivity and the palm rejection okay now this is all personal preference I just want to show you where it is and what you can do uh, you can explore the settings for yourself but it does increase the usability of the mouse tremendously. When you first get the computer, you might think it is a bad mouse as the reviews say. But I'm telling you, the mouse is my favorite. The trackpad is my favorite on any computer so far. Once you adjust it to your desired settings. Another cool feature that it has is while you're in Google Chrome, when you double, when you use a two finger, here, let me show you. When you use a two finger tap, like that, now let me show you the screen. Sorry, I'm using a transformer ca uh, uh, computer, well, tablet to record this, as I said before in previous videos. So, um, let's say you want to do a two finger tap, as I just showed you, on this link of Gmail. Double click one second and it opens Gmail in the background so on eBay double click well click with two fingers sorry I, I'm making mistakes because of the camera but let me try again so double click and it opens eBay in the background double click and it opens uh, slash gear in the background etc you can open everything in the background with a double click if you set up everything right and that is very useful for me personally so I just want to show you how to do that and hope you liked this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. New content is coming for lots of different technology and that's it. Hope you have a good one.